The USS Truxton, DD-14, was the first ship of the Truxton-class destroyers in the United States Navy. It was named after Commodore Thomas Truxton. The ship was constructed in Maryland and commissioned in September 1902. Initially assigned to the Second Torpedo Flotilla, Truxton underwent trials and participated in maneuvers and exercises off the East Coast. It later joined the Coast Squadron, North Atlantic Fleet, engaging in target practice and undergoing repairs. For the following years, Truxton operated along the Atlantic coast and in the Caribbean, with occasional incidents such as a minor collision in 1905. In 1907, it joined the Great White Fleet during its famous round-the-world voyage, escorting the fleet on its journey to Brazil, Chile, Peru, Panama, Mexico, and San Francisco. After repairs, Truxton continued its service along the Pacific coast, visiting Alaskan waters and various ports. During World War I, Truxton initially patrolled the area around the Panama Canal and later conducted patrols in Panama and Colombia, doubling as a submarine tender. It then sailed to the Azores, operating from Ponta Delgada and participating in escort duties and anti-submarine patrols. The ship convoyed merchant vessels and conducted patrols against German U-boats from Brest, France. Truxton had notable experiences during the war, including the rescue efforts during the SS Florence H. explosion and an encounter with a suspected enemy U-boat. After the armistice, it returned to the United States with other ships, arriving in January 1919. Truxton was decommissioned in July 1919 and eventually sold for conversion to a motor fruit carrier. It was ultimately scrapped in 1956. The USS Truxton service spanned from its commissioning in 1902 to its decommissioning in 1919, witnessing significant events and contributing to naval operations during a crucial period in history.